All right, turned out to be a very warm afternoon across the area. Temperatures reaching 80 degrees out at BWI, and we're expecting cooler weather to start filtering into the region later tonight and for your Friday, so we're not going to be as warm tomorrow. And we're also looking at a high chance for rain throughout the day, and some of it could be heavy at times. Let me show you what's going on, though. We're tracking a severe thunderstorm right now. This is for portions of West Virginia and down into sections of southwestern Washington County. You can see the storm kind of tracking its way towards the south and east. We'll go in there in just a second. But these are some of the showers that are popping up closer to home from the Towson area down to JFX here. So affecting areas around uh, perhaps Timonium and then getting over into parts of Cecil County, Harford County. But this is the storm I was talking about as it tracks towards the south and east. This severe thunderstorm warning in effect until 1130 tonight. Tonight, that does include Washington County. Possibility of quarter size hail here, mainly areas south of Boonesboro, as it tracks off towards the south and east. So it's going to clip the very south, southern portions of the county here, mainly south of Hagerstown. And uh, that'll eventually uh, likely fall apart, though, as it tracks into northern Virginia. But as you can see, temperatures are still fairly warm. Look at the contrast here 57 in Elkton, but you go down to College Park, it's still in the mid 70s. Naples right now at 77 degrees. So there clearly is a boundary right here. And that's what these storms are riding on as they track south and east here across the area. That will also serve as basically the railroad tracks for more showers and storms to track through our area here later tonight and during the day tomorrow. So here's your forecast overnight tonight. Notice how the chances for rain ramp up significantly by tomorrow morning. So it will be a wet Friday across the area. Reason why? See how everything is just kind of riding up and over. There's a big dome of high pressure that's over the southeast, and everything is riding up and over the top of this thing. And there's just like a pipeline of strong winds and moisture right in this area. And that's what we're going to be dealing with throughout the day tomorrow. So your future cast shows, again, chances for scattered showers overnight, but then the rain chances really start to ramp up by morning. I'd say my, right around the morning rush hour, but certainly by mid morning and into the afternoon. You can clearly see it right here. The darker greens indicating the heavier chances for perhaps some steadier rain. Temperatures are going to start off in the 60s and then fall off into the 50s here as we go into the rest of the day. Here's the first alert, the seven day forecast. And as you can see, we've got wet weather on the way here for tomorrow and through Friday night and Saturday. Good news is, though, the whole weekend will not be a washout. Sunshine does make its return Sunday with highs in the low 60s. Vic?